<sighs> Good morning, everyone. How you doing? Pam's at the other end of the table. Say good morning, Pam. Good morning, Pam. She's hilarious. I say good day. I say good day. So today, uh, I actually, I'm feeling. Sorry. For real? Well, that's why I always say, play that tune, Dizzy Gillespie. Play a little, a little of that smooth jazz. So I'm going to be going to Henry's. Uh, photo today uh, and looking at trading in my Canon 5D Mark III and its lens and getting something like a Canon 80D which is smaller kind of the same one that uh, that Chris has the, the 5D Mark III is an amazing camera I actually originally got it because I wanted to film with it uh, because actually there's a lot of indie films that use this camera. It's a really really good camera The lenses, you know, obviously can cost way more than the camera itself But I never I'm not fully utilizing it and it's way too expensive a piece of equipment for me to just having it sit there To take the odd picture or thumbnail totally not worth it So I'm looking to trade into something because I'm noticing with this camera and I don't want to point it out But I'm going to anyway is that while it's quiet when I'm not talking which is almost never uh, I can hear the motor kind of adjusting and trying to focus and everything like that inside. So this camera, I've gotten a ton of use out of this camera. Hey babe, this G7X one, oh, yeah. we use this camera all the time. But like anything, after a while it wears down. I was thinking of getting the G7X Mark II and then I was like, ah, you know what? I kind of really wanted to use my expensive mic on it, like the one that we use for Can We Survive? But this doesn't have a proper jack, and then if I get a G7X, like the next one, still doesn't have it. But the ADD does. It's a bit bigger, lighter than my Mark II, but I'll be able to use that good, good mic on it. And on this, it's just something to get used to. So that's my day. I'm going to eat this lemon cranberry muffin, drink my coffee, edit yesterday's vlog, and go to the store. Mmm. Well, I'm updating the drone again. There is an update that was needed. And yesterday, I don't know if you noticed it. I definitely noticed it, and you probably did notice it. It was a bit blurry in the intro drone shots. This thing, for whatever reason, is defaulted to 4K 24 frames per second, which is, well, 24 frames is what TV and uh, movies use. But it's not good when the rest of the, the film when the rest of the film uses uh, 60. So this camera here that I'm using right now is 60 frames. And I usually render it at 30 frames. But when you have 24, there's missing frames and everything like that, it makes it look, it makes it look choppy. Plus I didn't like the fact that it was blurry, but it is what it is. Always room for improvement, people. Always room for improvement. All right, well I'm off to go to Henry's photo. It's kind of like B&H photo, or just basically a photography uh, place, because I'm gonna be looking at trading in my Canon 5D Mark III and the lens that I bought with it as well. Um, so I'm hoping, if I don't get enough for them, if they don't offer enough in trade and value, then I'm not gonna give it to them. But I need, I wanna get the, it's not that I need, I'd like to get uh, the Canon 80D which is uh, a lot better for what I need. I can use it for vlogging, I can use it for can we survive, I can use, it's just a lot more useful. I don't take enough pictures to justify how expensive this camera is. So who knows, let's see how much uh, trade and value they get. Again, as I said, if they don't give me a lot, I'll just sell it privately. Maybe I'll put it online, maybe one of you guys want it, I'll give it at a very good price for it. The lens itself on this, if you were to buy it brand new, the lens is uh, I think 1500 or 1600 just for the lens alone, like brand new. And there's nothing wrong with this lens, it's even got a, one of the expensive uh, filters on it, a neutral filter to protect it, so anyway, I'm off. I got it, I traded it in, it was fair. I'm not gonna go into the details because obviously, you know, I didn't get, I, if I sold it privately, I would have gotten uh, probably 30, 40% more. And, and even the uh, associate there. I've dealt with Henry's a lot though. I mean, they looked up my number, they're like, whoa, like, okay, yeah, you're a good customer. and. They always treat me right, so he's like, yeah, you could sell it privately, you'll probably get, you know, 
this amount more like you're easily and and what he said was true because I already looked it up online I looked up used ones and um, and I was like yeah that's in line with what I've seen but I'm like I don't want to go through the hassle of selling it and then waiting I just you know this camera is on its way out I can already hear it it's gonna be a pain in the butt curing the other one but hopefully tomorrow starting tomorrow the next vlog for tomorrow is gonna to be using the all new ADD. Better sound, should have a better picture. Maybe you don't notice, I don't know. I will when I'm editing it, for sure, I will notice that, but uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. And I'm excited, I'm excited to use it. I'm, you know, I'm upgrading my, my equipment without having to spend a lot of money. I lose money on it, but I'm not using that other camera. I gotta go home, because I gotta go and record in 15 minutes. Mm, not happening. Are you poking him with your fork? <laughs> yes. Come on, you're eating. Cal. Cal, come on. I was... Cal, I anyway. Was what? what? What's wrong with you guys? Yeah, you hush. Mommy's trying to vlog. Boots, get out. You guys are bugging because you haven't been fed yet. Oh, boots. <laughs> Jeez, get down. I got chicken nuggets tonight for feed, the kids. I will feed the cats. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I'm amazing. And uh, I don't really like chicken nuggets because I don't find like they're not healthy. But the kids like them and yeah, it's okay. filling them up. And so I'm balancing it with salad. Focus. And cut up cucumber. It's cut up cucumber and onions in vinegar and water. My mom made them. Grandma made those when we were growing up. And they are so good. You guys like them too, right? Mm -hmm. So yeah, you should try it. Cut up a cucumber. I do like half water and half vinegar, so it's not like super strong. And then, you know, cut up an onion if you want. Toss that in there, a little bit of pepper. And let it sit for like half an hour before you eat them. Just so the uh, cucumbers become infused with the vinegar. Isn't this that is amazing? an off-topic question, mm -hmm. but what would happen if I blew up the moon? I want to say too, oh my god, I'm dreaded, whatever, I'm sorry, sorry you gotta look at this mug, but I do feel better, I feel better today, I think I'm finally getting rid of this stupid flu, I still have the cold, and I'm still sweaty, and, but after yesterday, yesterday was terrible, because I lost my friend Dolores, but today I feel better, a little bit better mentally, a little bit better physically. You can only get better, right, Elin? But thank you, everybody, for your support and your well wishes in the comments. We always read the comments, and uh, you know, just knowing that we have a lot of friends out there and gives us good feels right here, right here. Hey, Cal, do you get the good feels, Ewan? Yes. All right. I obtain good feels. You're a ding dong. Mm, here's Floyd. Floyd's watching Dr. Phil. He's looking at the TV. He's like, that guy's a real jerk. I'd like to bite him in the ankle. He's really mean. Hey, Floyd. You're so funny. You make me laugh. You make me laugh when you sit like this. Oh, my God. He always puffs out his chest. He's funny. He's a funny bee. There's Rammel with his popcorn. It's time for popcorn. Yeah, that guy was a total jerk today. Does anybody here watch Dr. Phil? Oh, my God. Anyway, I got a surprise for Niels. I'm gonna make some homemade soup. I'm gonna make a homemade potato and leek soup. Cause somebody in the comments on one of the videos said, make potato and leek soup. And I had an, I've had a craving for it. Anybody know this uh, cookbook? It's pretty hilarious. It's Thug Kitchen. Got a lot of bad language in it, so I can't show it. Cause you know, don't wanna get demonetized, but to clean up this mess and then I gotta get my potato and leek soup going. I will definitely show you guys how it turns out. Niels. Mm. What, is Liam having some too? What did you make? Yeah, what kind of soup? Liam, you're getting it all over the place. Of course slob. he is. Are you capable oh, of getting anything without Liam. making a mess? Look at this. <clears throat> and now you're gonna... Uh, it's potato and leek. Ooh, actually I love potato and leek. I know. Mm. So do I. I'll get you a bowl. I don't want a lot. I'm not very hungry, but okay. I'll still get I'll have you. a little you bowl. Want a bowl though? Can you smell it? Yeah. Mm. Where are those? Uh, it looks like baby spoons. poo. 
the soup spoons? I don't know. I think Liam, you still. Oh God. Liam, here. Wipe the, the outside of the bowl. Hey, hey. Wipe the outside of the bowl. They're slop. Should, should we just oh, use Liam. these then? They're not soup bowls. No, that's fine. This should be all right. I'm all done work. Hungry. All I had to eat was one of those. Uh, what? Diamond chest plate. <laughs> Classic maneuver. Is that what that is? Tell me. You want another scoop? I'll have a little bit more. Thank you. Like that? Yeah. That's yours. I th I'm not hungry, but I'm I, gonna. That's have because some. you're sick. Niels. Sick in the head. Is that because I'm sick? No. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, I know I made it. Tell me I what love you your homemade soups. I know you do. I do too. I'm uh, really good the, at it. The other one that you made that was super amazing. There's leek and fennel. Leak that's a good fennel. That That's a real good one too. Spoons. Okay. That spoon is too big for me, but nope. whatever. Okay. Are you kidding me? What well, you're saying you don't have a big mouth? Whatever. I can hear you. Mm. Hot. Oh. Mm, it's very good. Oh, it's hearty too. It's like a perfect winter soup. You like it? Mm-hmm. Do you want to bathe in it? Uh. Oh. Jesus. We're a super classy family. Well, the soup is delicious. I got uh, the camera all set up for tomorrow's vlog. We're going to be starting using the new camera setup. I'm going to show you it just because I can. So there might be a bit of a difference. I did notice, and actually it was uh, Pamela was looking at it too, uh, when we just did a test record, it's a bit grainy in the dark, only because the lens itself, I'm surprised this lens is actually that good. I don't know what the f-stop is on this. If you know anything about photography, if you lower the f-stop or whatever, the better it is in low light. And this one's like four or five, so it's not the greatest, but the image is good. The sound quality would be great. So this is what the, the new camera that I'll be vlogging with. So you can't see, it, it's pretty big. You know what I mean? Like you're like, what the heck? This thing here is the actual Pro Mic. This is uh, the Rode Pro X, uh, X mic here. You basically, in terms of mics, you can't get anything better than this. This thing is incredible. It's not a shotgun mic, which, you know, just takes all a shotgun mic does is it's like if, if it point at something, it's gonna pick that sound up better. This is a surround sound uh, mic, so you're gonna hear everything around us. The clarity of it is really good. It's a really high-end mic, and it allows me to plug it into this. This is the Canon 80D. 80, as in the number, and then D, not ADD, as in attention deficit disorder. And then this is a little lens here that's a 10 to 18 millimeter. And it allows me to basically, you know, look at myself without putting the camera super far away. I don't have to hold the camera super far back. I can have it this close up and it's gonna look fine. I just gotta get used to the weight of it. So hopefully uh, the next vlog that you see is going to be using that and hopefully everything turns out. Because this motor in here, I can hear it when I'm, I don't know, maybe you guys, I shouldn't even say anything. You're like, oh, I hear it too. It's so annoying. Huh. Whatever, people. I'm doing my best here. We'll see you guys in the next vlog. Hopefully better, huh? Sound and visual quality a little bit, maybe. Yeah, it is what it is. Squish your head. Oh, look at this. It's a 3.40 a.m. kitty convention. Because mummy's up. Hey, mummy's up. Yeah, there you go. Mummy had to come down and get some orange juice. So of course, all the kitties come around. Because they want to have a kitty convention. Because <laughs> everybody brings treats to the kitty convention. Except Fiona, you were a little bitchy. And you hissed at Fiona, our buddy over here. So now she doesn't want to come over. You have to be a team player, Fiona. When there's treats involved, you have to be a team player, okay? You can't hog them all. Buddy gets some too, okay? All right. Now let mommy get her orange juice and go back to bed. <coughs> yes, that's right. Don't worry, buddy. I got your back. Hey, Fiona. Don't be so bitchy, okay? Yeah, you go say sorry to buddy. Come on, you guys be friends. Yeah, you're so pretty though. It's okay. 
I know. Where's Boots? Boots, you need to be a team leader. You gotta keep the peace here, okay? You gotta do your best. Alright. Mommy's going back to bed. <laughs>